Hey guys, Terry here. Um, it is fall and the leaves are starting to change colors. It's getting a little cooler outside. Uh, my husband is currently outside blowing <laughs> leaves off the deck, so maybe you can hear that. I hope you can't. Um, but I wanted to do a video today to show I got my um, order in for uh, my Kiwi Lane uh, templates. So I want to show those to you today. So I had previously shown my storage box here, and it's working great. This is an envelope I have of a few of the card ones. Uh, they're proportionally made so that the shapes fit more on the front of a standard A2 size card. Um, but this is how I was doing my um, Kiwi Lane. I had them in this and I had previously taken pieces of plastic and traced somebody else's Kiwi Lane. Um, so I realized that that is um, not a good thing to do because you're copying somebody's copyrighted material. So I wanted to show that I am now replacing my plastic and then I simply had made like a little cheat card on the what they were and that helped separate these. So I'm excited to take those out and put in the new um, ones that I just bought. And Kiwi Lane used to be that you just ordered them from their um, website and now they have people that um, can help you, that live near you and they are representatives of Kiwi Lane. And that's pretty cool that they've gone to that um, method because that way people can do it as a business. And then you've got someone locally that you can ask questions to. So for example, this one's called Cascade Trails. They all come with um, suggestions and then this little ring. And they give you the ring because they have poked a hole in the end of each one. And then you can take the ring and that is meant to help keep them um, together and organized. So you can see this set here is made up of different curves. Here's one with a point on it. So this one's called Cascade Trails. And it's just a variety of different curves. I think there's two of each. Here's 1A. All the A's go together and the B's go together. So 1A, 1A and 1B. That's one set. And then 2A and 2B. And even though they're the same, their system is meant so that you can lay it out on your two-page spread and decide how to um, how you're going to do it on your paper. So they, even though the, if you lay them on top of each other, they're the same. I guess they're a little bit different. Yeah, they're very similar. But the idea is that when you're making your page up, you can lay it out on your paper and decide what color of paper you're going to use for each of those pieces. So that's the Cascade Trails. And like I said, you can hook them together with the ring that comes together. And it's just a nice way to keep the ones that are similar in style to be kept together. And then um, they have a book also, and their book of ideas shows you which one of these to use. So my plan is to have those on the ring and then storm them in this. Um, this is just a really long um, pencil case. Um, I'll try to find this on Amazon and do a link to it. But that's what I'm going to do for each of my um, new templates that I bought. And they've got a good variety. And I like to keep the um, original insert because it has the good ideas 
you know, it just has a good sampling of ideas on how to use it, and then it shows what it looks like. So I'll probably use those as dividers inside my case. And all I'm trying to do is avoid having to put them back inside the plastic, plus the plastic rips over time. So I will hook them together with the ring. So maybe they're not doing the ring anymore. But I'll use this cardboard here as the divider in my box. And I think they'll all lay in here nicely. And then maybe I'll even put tabs on the top or something so I can tell them apart. I'm sure they get mixed up over time, but they do have the uh, names on them inside there. So I'm excited to get them. They've got all kinds of um, shapes and sizes. And it's all meant to work with your pattern paper. So I love their system. And um, just over time, I'll collect the different. Um, these were $16. And um, they're just a good way to use your pattern paper because then you can layer all the different pattern paper. And I'll link to some of my other um, example scrapbooking um, videos where I've used them. So thanks, guys. I'm just going to add one more thing here. I got out my label maker, and I think I am going to put a label on the top of these um, so that I can recognize which one they are. This one, it says it on the bottom, but when I've got them all stacked up in here, I want to see it across the top here. So let me show you. this across the top there. I'll just better show it across the top. So I'll do that for each one and then I can flip through them. Okay, so I'll have links to these products on my website. Thanks. Okay, one last final note. Um, I've got them in here and they are fitting well. And then when I go to use them, I'll set them up and then I can see them. And then I can refer to the backs for good ideas. So I've got them all in there. And then I wanted to show you the book too. Um, I think they've even got a third book. This is the second one. This is volume two. Um, but I wanted to show you um, some of the ways they use the... Um, items in here. So for example this one, that one caught my eye there. So you can see where they've used different pattern paper. They used a pattern at the top that was just straight across and then they used the brackets and the scallops and on the bottom they used the cascading trails. So I just think that's gorgeous. So the idea is that you use those templates to trace on your paper uh, you, first you use it to get idea, kind of lay it out on your layouts uh, per your pictures and then see which ways you could use it. And the book is just full of so many ideas. Um, so I do recommend um, getting the book because there's just so many cute ideas. Um, I haven't bought the embellishments. I always figured I could cut those on my Cricut. Um, the thing with their system is if you have those and you pop them out and you trace around them and cut them, it's quicker than, than getting out your electronic device. So, um, But I usually have buttons and flowers and ribbons and other things that I decorate the page with. So, um, But yeah, I, I recommend getting the book. It's just got thousands of ideas in it. And then um, as part of the instructions, it tells you what sets it used. So I just think it's a good way to um, get inspired and then um, know what sets to use. 
and then I think in the back, yeah. So you can kind of keep your inventory back here of which ones you've, which ones you've purchased. And they've just got so many shapes and stuff for cards. Um, I did notice the rings stopped coming with them in about 2018. So they must have learned that people are kind of storing them flat and not with the rings. But I'm going to keep the rings because I can use these for other little mini books that I make. So they'll still come in handy. But yeah, guys, I wanted to show you the, um, the Kiwi Lane system. I don't sell it, um, but you can go on their site and find someone locally in your area that does and can help you. Thanks.